everyone welcome back to Gums Tech Talks channel in this video we're going to see the UGC CAD journal um, which is in computer science we'll be understanding all the various factors which you have to consider before submitting your, your article okay so we'll also check whether it is there in Scopus as well as I'll tell you how to find whether it is a cloned journal or not as well so before we proceed I'd like to tell you that if you haven't subscribed to my channel please go and subscribe here okay this is Gomes Tech Talks channel and you can find a lot of information for the researchers specifically on the journal publication and everything so this is all about research you will definitely find this particular playlist useful because all the hurdles whatever I have faced in my research I have explained that in an easiest way for you to do that okay so this playlist will be helpful for you right from writing a letter to the editor finding a clone journal and um, um uh, best uh, plagiarism checking website text summarizer so everything you can find it here and the next important playlist which you should sh uh, see is what other sei scopus and annexure uh, ugc cad journal just this is another uh, important playlist where i'll be updating uh, um, journals like this or uh, the list of journals every week so i'm planning for daily one journal daily okay one journal a day so let us see how um, it's it is possible so let us yes so the next one which i want to tell you is what this is my top med account so if you want to talk to me regarding your research if you have any queries if you want to prepare for your interview uh, mock interview if you want me to conduct a mock interview any resume review career guidance whatever you can just connect with me through this call i'll be happy to help you out okay so the links are in the description so please go and check that first so let us see the UGC CARE journal, uh, which is um, which is on computer science, uh, computer networks and communications is what International Journal of Information Security Science. So here you can find if you click on this link, OK, you can find that this is still in UGC CARE. I'm talking about the April month data. OK, so if you are watching this video uh, in the month of uh, October 2024 or November 2024, even after. So please recheck before you submit. This is the very first uh, request which I wanted to tell you, please recheck whether it is still there in UGC or Scopus or whatever we are just discussing you know you have to check that first okay and once you have checked that second one is you have to check whether it is under your scope of your uh, article which you are planning to publish so this is what aim and scope of the journal so what is the aim of the journal and what is um, uh, what are the topics which they are covering so here they have clearly mentioned this does not charge any publication or processing fee so the charges we have uh, done you don't want to worry about this just scroll down you can see what are the scope of this journal cyber security blockchain cryptocurrency coding data privacy wireless networks big data everything okay so you can find almost all the important key aspects of this particular journal and here you can also see that the acceptance rate is 17 percentage what do you mean by this acceptance rate for example if someone if uh, for the month of jan if this particular um, journal is um, getting 100 papers okay 100 articles from different authors then they will be accepting only 17 articles out of this hundred okay uh, seems to be a little low but yes uh, it is uh, this is a well renowned journal we can also check whether it is there in scopus as well so don't worry so this so far we have found few information about this particular journal then you should go and check for the information for the author so you can just click on about okay so you can find the information for the authors like what are the things which you wanted to uh, which you should consider when you wanted to submit your thing if there is nothing regarding the authors then you can just go ahead and click here writing rules okay like how you have to write this particular um particular um, paper okay so you have you have to just go ahead and uh, check the writing rules here like um they have given some um uh, uh, latex download or uh, templates to download 
and you can find like how you can resubmit everything here so the thing is what you should check the complete um thing like what is the principles and publication policy um, um what is the plagiarism policy what is the accepted rate of the percentage of plagiarism how uh, how far they are accepting the plagiarism rates and everything okay so you can check here for every uh, each and every details like what are the technical controls you can find it uh, proof uh, editor editor in chief so see submission exceeding 30 percent uh, score um, yeah similarity index is higher than the permitted threshold okay uh, there is no single number for the similarity percentage since each report is investigated in detail but submission exceeding 30 percentage of the score are generally written to the authors see while submitting you should consider all these things like plagiarism okay whether it is uh, uh, binding to all the um, uh, template which they are giving it to you to submit it and the third important point is what whether it is still it is there in uh, the scope of your journal article so everything you have to check before you submit okay and once it is submitted you can submit it you have to log in i think you have to create an account and log in submit your data and then if you have any queries you can just contact them you can f uh, send a mail mail to them to this particular mail id and contact if you have any queries regarding this particular submission okay um so let us see whether it is there in the scopus so this is the scopus uh, uh, data so what is this international journal of information security science just go and type international journal of information security science international journal of information security science is this what right yes but i think it is not there in the scopus and of information security science though so it's not there in the scopus so it's only in ugc care okay so this one you can uh, check uh, so yes, uh, these are the important factors which you should consider before you submit it. And one more thing to find whether it is a clone journal or not. One one thing which you have to do, we can do is what you can go and check it in your uh, UGC uh, um, ID itself, like you uh, here itself, because uh, they have mentioned that the list of cloned journals in the UGC portal itself okay so you can go and cross check here so here they have given you list of ugc care cloned journal group one and group two you can simply check here before you submit it and uh, i have also um, um, added one video on how to check the clone journal okay so uh, so cloned journal can find uh, know about clone journals what is a clone journal okay so once if you click here you can f understand about what is the clone journal and how to identify that uh, so you can find it here on uh, and uh, try to identify whether or the journal which you are going to choose which you are going to submit is whether clone journal or not so that's all about the today's video and the next video uh, i am receiving a lot and lot of comments for the um, subject to be discussed i will soon discuss that in the uh, uh, videos because i'm planning for um, uh, daily videos or at least three videos a, a week so don't worry i'll be discussing about that thank you take care and bye bye